the, the Tybernia area of Paddington, come the evening, the way the lighting is and the narrow houses, it's like a theatrical set. And in some ways, it's almost like you've gone back in time. I'm always looking for something fresh. Just finding extraordinary things in ordinary things, I suppose. So anyway, after being in London, I went on a trip to Mallorca. And I've been a few times and there's this uh, fishing village called Chisteca. There's probably about 14 buildings there. There's no shops, no bar or anything. And there's uh, one fisherman that lives there. And the rest of it is in sort of, sort of neglected, really. Basically moved in for the whole of October. Pretty uh, monastic experience. It was like being on the edge of the world. In, in some ways, it doesn't matter where you are. I think you do a lot of exploring in your mind when you're on your own. Yeah, I was right by the sea and you could hear the waves beating just below the building and the weather changed a lot that time of year in October. Definitely felt you as alive and it didn't feel haunted or anything like that, but it, it did feel quite mysterious. went to see a friend and he said, oh, when you go back, remember to take a right at this point. And so I started walking back and for some reason I took a left. Suddenly it came alive to me and I thought, wow, this is, this is what I want to paint. The good thing is that there was a lot of driftwood there, so I started doing a lot of carving as well. It's, it's like trying to explore a piece of wood and to find something within it, like the, the idea of how form is created by two objects being together. If you go away for a time, you come back home or back to London and you see everything with fresh eyes for a moment. You just open the front door, there's a whole life out there. I just painted what was around me and I, I found it quite inspiring. Seeing them out of context, it's almost like somebody else had painted them. And it's in some ways it's like that sort of chapter is closed. I do sort of see them as like sort of poems in paint. It's sort of like, yeah, a bit moody.